20 off in three months the last time we played against them. So, uh, you know, I feel like they did a better job with that this time around. Is there, on that inbounds play where they end up lobbing it to uh, Henson, it doesn't seem like when a guy picks 11 with long arms and can jump it, there's a whole lot you can do unless you foul him on that. Yeah, no, that was tough. I mean, uh, you know, we knew there was two seconds left, and uh, they probably had to get a, a shot at the rim. And, uh, you know, it was a good set that they ran, and I don't know. I mean, he made a great play, and he was able to put it down. It felt like you kind of took another step forward in your recovery today. You yeah. were able to make some shots, do some things, do some block some shots. Yeah. No, I mean, I don't know. I just, I guess beforehand I was kind of, I don't know, using my hand almost as an excuse, you know, for myself that, I don't know, it's broken so what, nobody else really expects me to do anything. And I was kind of, you know, taking that on myself and not expecting much from myself. So I, I just kind of just, just like had the mindset of, you know, forgetting, you know, forget all that. I just, you know, regardless of having a broken hand or not, I still need to contribute and help a team out. You know, the two blocks, I mean, you came across the lane on both of those, right? That was, one wasn't your guy, right? No. Did you go through, I guess, what lead up to those? Or did I mean, I don't know. I just, yeah, reaction. And uh, I don't know. Coach has been talking a lot lately about, you know, not giving nothing easy when the guys get into the paint. And uh, I don't know. I just kind of came off my man. I didn't notice that he wasn't, you know, crashing or diving or anything like that. So I was able to, you know, kind of help my guys out. Is it the same contraption on the hand, or has it been trimmed down at all? Or? Uh, it's been trimmed a little bit. Uh, it, like, cut it. Um, I have a less opposite thumb, so I can move my thumb around a lot more. Uh -huh. It's more just kind of on like this side of my two fingers. So it's a lot better than it than it had been. Um, I guess, or, yeah, yeah, it is a lot better. It feels a lot better on my hand because like, they're able to you know trim it down um, as the weeks go on and like as my rehab and that stuff you know progresses. Yeah, what's the timetable for that? Will it be cut down like in another couple um, days before I, the next game? Or? Yeah, yeah, they'll still cut it down and it'll go, it'll get thinner. But uh, I still have to wear. I might have to wear the cash for the rest of the year, but it'll gradually um, you know, get thinner and get cut down. It's your best games since you had that on is you're starting to feel more comfortable out there with playing well this one hand? Yeah, definitely. I mean, like I was saying earlier, I just, uh, you know, I try not to really, really, you know, think about having a broken hand, I guess, or worried about having a cast and uh, or trying to go out there and play like you know, I did the rest of the, the season. Three big blocks, really seem to pick tight the crowd. Did you talk about you know, three big blocks for um, I mean, guys, I just was able to help out my guy a little bit. Uh, as I was saying earlier, how um, you know when I I was guarding before, and every, each time that the guy got beat to the, I don't know if it was the baseline or no or whatever, um, I was able to kind of go off my guy because he wasn't diving or uh, crashing on me.